Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Yaya and I'm so excited to finally be doing this. I have wanted to have my own YouTube channel for so stinking long and I've always had a million reasons on why it wasn't the time and now I'm just going for it. You know what, I need something good from 2020 and this is gonna be it. So, for my first video, I am going to be doing a TikTok Made Me Buy It. I have been hooked on that app like crazy and once I realized that they had like basically a shopping list on it, I was stuck. I literally was going in, putting in hashtag Amazon must haves or Dollar Tree must haves and just getting lost and I found myself buying a lot of the things that they told me to buy. So I just want to show you guys I will have all of the links except for Dollar Tree because <laughs> just go to your Dollar Tree but I will have all of the links from Amazon or Ulta down below so if you guys think you might need these products which you probably don't um you guys can pick them up as well. So, I have my little book here because I wrote down all the prices. Now, mind you, with Amazon, a lot of them do change here and there. As popularity goes up, they do kind of up the price a little bit. So, I'm going to tell you guys what I purchased mine at. First thing is, so funny, it is my, oh, I just pressed one. It's my key finder. Um, my boyfriend loses his keys every day, every second, all the time. He has two sets, bad idea, and um, he loses them all the time. So I bought this in hopes that we would never have that issue again because he'll literally wake me up at the crack of dawn to help him find his keys. And it's really cool, it's a little remote control you can list, they give you a little paper so you can list what key is what. I just brought him one of his sets. So his is green and then if you're ever losing it, you just press the button and it'll be. And that's until you find it, I think. So yeah, I really like that. I got that on Amazon for $21.99. Oh, it does come with this little holder too. Um, the next thing, I have everything here kind of stacked, so don't mind me as I'm like trying to find things. The next thing I picked up was this Bottle Bright. I am a water bottle freaking fanatic. My boyfriend says it's a collection thing of mine, and it really is. I love to have, you know, water bottles. <laughs> I don't know why I don't even use them all, but my... My dog is crying. I promise you guys he's not being harmed. He's just obsessed with me. Okay. Um, my flask, it's not a hydro flask, it's like a knockoff. You know, if you put other drinks in there, which my brother has, they get stinky, they hold that funk. Mason was using mine as a coffee um, cup for a long time. So I seen these on TikTok, one of the girls showed hers, it was like all brown inside, and you put one of these in the bottle with warm water, and let it sit for 15 to 30 minutes, and it soaks all of that up, and it doesn't have that smell anymore either. They have um, bigger packs. I got a 12 pack because I don't need them that much. They really don't need these at all, but you know, it's a gimmick and I like it and um, I will buy your gimmicks. So I got this, the 12 pack for $7.98. Oh, this is another fun thing. <laughs> another thing I don't actually need and I haven't even used it yet. This is the Go Stack from Blender Bottle. I am starting to bring my lunches to work again and really starting to save money and bring little snacks. So I got this because I thought it was pretty cute and one of the girls said I had to have it on TikTok and so I believed her. And yeah, it's a little stackable plastic container and you can put like, you know, almond butter and stuff in there or, you know, ranch for your veggie stick. So I got that for $6.26, random price on Amazon. Yeah. Uh, the next thing I got, I'm not going to try these on you guys because I look kind of funny because my head is a little too big for them, but I got these blue light glasses for $10.99. Again, one of the girls said you should have these um, if you're on your phone at the time, which I clearly am buying all this crap. And also I do, I have a desk job, so I am on my computer a lot too. Um, and yeah, I've worn them a couple times. I don't know if it's in my head or if they really do make a difference, but it did, you know, I mean, I like them and they're cute on even though my head is too big. Um, so I got those for 10 dollars This, <laughs> I clowned a lot of people before for having these and now I am on the bandwagon because they're cute. And I got 55 scrunchies, velvet scrunchies for $5.25. They come in all of the colors that you can think of. But yes, I got 55 pieces of scrunchies for $5.25. Again, TikTok said I needed it and I listened. I just believed them. 
And the next thing is this hair finishing stick. This is what it looks like. It's um, supposed to help with your flyaways or your broken hair. And let me tell you guys, I am the CEO, founder, queen of flyaways. I have my hair in a ponytail and have my little curly baby hairs all over the place. Don't even care about it, okay? So when they seen that, when I seen this, I was like, okay, you know what? Because I kind of sometimes want to have a slick, you know, you know, like back in the day, you used to like spray your hair, your bangs onto your forehead. Sometimes I kind of want to have that vibe going. So this is what it looks like. It's literally just a mascara. I'm pretty sure it's just like brow gel. You could probably use it on your brows. But I will say the other day, I did use it lightly in my hair when I went to work. And it did hold them down. I don't remember checking if it held them down all day, but it did hold them down. So I picked that up for $5.98. Um, I don't know if you need this. It'll be listed down below. The next thing is this eyelash applicator. I honestly, I don't even need this. I don't wear lashes ever, but I have hella lashes that I do want to wear. Um, I tried lash extensions early this year and it lasted like two weeks on me. So not to say that the quality of the girl that did my lashes wasn't good. She was fabulous. But I think because I'm just so oily, I just did not say. But I got this because it looks like it's pretty heavy duty. It feels sturdy too. And I watched this girl on TikTok just like boop, boop, one and done. Um, so I was like, oh, I can do that. And I thought, let's try it out. So I got this for $4.98. You guys will see, I'm very very frugal. I would not buy anything over $20. I think there's only one. Oh yeah, my key finder was $21.99. That's the only thing I think I purchased that was over that amount because no boo boo. We're not going broke because of TikTok. You know, we're being cute and we're having fun. But oh, this next thing I got, I was really excited about. It's a closet space saver. I seen one of the girls that was on the Amazon must haves and I believed her. I do need this because my man has so many clothes. It's ridiculous. The amount of band tees this kid has is crazy. Um, it's wild. But this is what it looks like. You can hang it like this in your closet and then, but I don't think that saves space at all. So what I did is, what the other option is, is I hung it like this and I hang, you know, five shirts here. It says it can hold 30 pounds. I'm not trying to risk it uh, because if you think about how many pounds that is on your main rod for your closet that's a little risky so i just did you know five shirts on this yeah i got those <laughs> and those were 14.99 this next thing i got oh you guys i love this thing where is it here it is this is and this is the box it came in i kept everything so you guys can see it uh, this is called the nano spray it's a portable steamer it's awesome i would recommend that you put filtered water in here like i did because you know you don't want faucet water steaming at your pores but you just pull this down and look isn't that so cool i paid 14.99 for this so yeah this is really awesome let's just show you guys again because it's so stinky cool um and it did come with the charger because it's a usb charger this you guys is my most favorite thing that TikTok made me buy. This is the Urban RX Even Tone Cleansing Bar. It's a three-in-one treatment. It brightens, improves, and even skin tone. Um, it's a three-in-one because it can be used as a cleanser, a mask, and an exfoliator. I, you guys, you guys, honestly, this is so stinking good. I am a skincare freaking fanatic. I cannot make this up. I love skincare. I um, used to be heavily only into makeup, but then I really got into my skin and taking care of my skin, realizing that, you know, good makeup starts with good skin. And, you know, I also work for Clinique and they're all about skincare, so I learned so much. And this, you guys, this isn't the only cleanser I use. But this is my base, like this is the one I gravitate towards to every single day. It comes with two of these little thin things that once you wet them, you know, it expands. And but this is what it looks like. You literally just wet your sponge, swirl it in there, and then do your skin. And you can um, leave it on for three minutes before rinsing. I adore this. I'm telling you guys, it's completely transformed my skin. Like. Obviously, I am using other things too, and it did they all together. Hold on, Bubba. Just wants attention. They all. Just a sec. 
I would even go as far as saying that that Urban RX has cleared up my uneven skin tone on my jaw. Um, and I paid $14.99 for that. I know there's other ones that are all over TikTok too, but this is the one that I chose because even skin tone is a really important thing for me because I do have uh, scarring from hormonal breakouts. And this, you guys, I, this is the one thing I will totally recommend. I got mine on Amazon for $14.99. I know you can get it at Target, but my Target didn't carry it, so I just went through Amazon because I have Prime faster shipping. But find it. I believe it sold at um, Sephora too. The other thing I picked up was this. And I have seen this around for so long, but I was a skeptical. But y'all, TikTok said, and I listened, you guys. First of all, this container is humongous. I paid $12.90 for this large container. It is a Aztec clay mask. This is what it looks like. Can you guys see it? Yes. Um... This is supposed to help with pores, and this is a version two. I have not used mine yet because I deal with eczema on my skin too, and if my skin is a little bit agitated, things like this can rough it up a little bit, so I um, haven't done it yet, but I want to. It's a deep pore cleansing. Um, this is version two. If you guys have used this and you've... If you guys have used this and you've used version one and version two or one of the version one first, let me know if there's a huge difference. Also, you need to have apple cider vinegar for this and I don't have that yet, so that's why I haven't used it. You can use water, but I wanna get the full benefits of it, so I wanna wait and get some apple cider vinegar. Um, and then the same person, the same TikTok that said I needed this, also said I needed this. This is a face bowl set for $6.95. I haven't even opened it yet because, you know, I haven't had a purpose, but let's do it together, y'all. So it comes with a bowl to mix that. This is what she used it for, where she mixed that Aztec healing mask. In this, it comes with a spatula, an applicator with um, two applicators. That's cute. Three applicators in a brush applicator which I used to use a brush to put on my mask I don't like it at all because I just feel like the bacteria and things no just just a no so I paid $6.95 for this and um, love it <laughs> that was excessive so there was a couple things that from Ulta that they talked about it was really just one thing and it was this a H a 30% peeling solution. I already had this, so it was pretty simple for me to just go into my um, thing and get it. This is what it looks like. Now, the first time you use this, you guys, it stings a little bit. I thought it was just because I have eczema, but even when my skin was really soft and clear at the time, I used it, it stings. So just be wary of that. But because of you know that being so popular, I already loved the Ordinary brand, so I decided to go on into that Ulta hashtag on TikTok and see what other people were also using. This is the Alpha Arbutin 2%. This is something I had been looking for for so stinking long at my Ulta, and they were always out of stock. Um, and I found it on, I just, oh, I bought it online. And um, yeah, this is supposed to be for uneven skin tone, which obviously, like I said, is a really big thing for me. And then this is another peeling mask. It's called a lactic acid 10%. And this is supposed to help with texture. So again, you guys, I am a skincare fanatic. So if you guys want to see some things about skincare, let me know because it's my favorite thing to talk about, period. Um, so now we'll switch over to the Dollar Tree must-haves. I was really surprised with this hashtag. I was like kind of wowed by the things that they were purchasing because I'm so scared about certain things on my skin. But the first thing is this jade roller. They have another one that's whiter that people were actually raving about. They said this one breaks easy. It hasn't broken on me yet. And I really like it. I keep mine in my little skincare fridge. The reason why I chose this size is because it gets around my eyes too so I like it a lot I don't know really the benefits too much of why a jade roller is important but I like it and it feels good I guess it does help with circulation I will say that it does make my skin feel a little less puffy in the morning these little face scrubbers which obviously I've already gotten into um I like them a lot uh, they remind me of Neutrogena used to have something like this way back in the day day but this is only a dollar and you get two of them I like I said I'm a multi-cleanser so I, obviously I don't use it with my Urban RX but I use it with my gel cleansers 
and I just, you know, in the shower, get all around my skin. It definitely, I feel like it really helps with circulation as well. I don't, I won't say that it really helps with exfoliating or if it really helps with like, you know, um, deep cleansing the skin, but I like how it feels in the morning. I would only use this in the morning. I don't know. At night, I'm just a little more gentle on my skin. I was watching Laura Lee's video of her Amazon must-haves, like part two, and she had something just like this for like $12, and Dollar Tree has it for one stinking dollar. So this is supposed to help massage your scalp. I get dry scalp. I think it's associated with my eczema, so I like to use something every now and then to really clean, cleanse my scalp. Um, so I think this will definitely help, and I like that it's it's like sturdy, but it's silicone, so it's not like going to scrape your scalp up, you know? Um, oh, I also picked up some extra sponges for my Urban RX cleanser. And TikTok did say you need to have these, so I got it. And TikTok also says you needed this. Now, I didn't see these hashtags until after I purchased the bowl set. But yeah, you guys, this feels just as similar as the ones in there, so I would pick these up. Blemish patches. Okay, so this one wowed me because Hello TikToker said you needed to have this, but then I came across another TikToker that was actually a skin therapist, and she said you had to have these. I haven't had a breakout yet to use them, but I do feel something right here, so I'm probably going to use it today. Um, they come in two different sizes, and what's weird to me is there's no salicylic acid or like benzoyl peroxide or anything in this product. It's like hot milk glue and other things that I just don't want to even try to say right now but it's non-medicated which is so weird to me but she said like it's a bomb and you have to use them so i'm gonna use this tonight because i have someone creeping on me right now. oh there's one more thing here tiktok did tell me that i needed castor oil for my lashes and for my brows and i went to go look for tick for castor oil but it was expensive and honey like i said i'm frugal but it just so happens that one of my really good friends my girl was selling these. Uh, this is Cash Oil. She's a brow expert. She has her own salon. She is the brow guru out here. And she was selling these two for eight dollars. And it's castor oil that you can put on your brows, make your brows grow. So came in this little pouch. Instead of what TikTok was saying I needed, I bought these instead because you know, support your um local businesses. One, to support your girl. Three, um, hello, two for eight. So I don't know if she has more of those, but if she does, I'll put her Instagram down below. So that concludes my TikTok haul. Um, again, you guys, I'm so excited to finally be doing this. I've wanted to do this for so stinking long. If there's something you guys want to see from me, if you guys want to get into skincare, if you guys want to get into some product reviews and things like that, let me know. I'm going to be doing more videos like this and more, but also I'm going to do some DIYs and some house renovation things because we are changing up our house. And yeah, again, I'm really, really excited. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Give me some feedback because it only goes up from here. Also, little disclaimer, you guys. I ordered everything online from my own Zola's. But when I did go to Dollar Tree, I did wear a mask. I did wear my gloves. Stay home. Follow the shelter in place order. You guys can save lives by just staying a little butt home. That's it. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll check back with y'all next time. Bye. Hey. Yeah, 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 yeah.